is how I play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone. Warning. What you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Sound good? Alright. That's... Sounds good to me. Please, guys, if you support the stream, please tip tonight. I really need the help with tips for the next two weeks until I get paid by Twitch and then things will get back to normal, okay? <laughs> Oh, I slid into the fireball. That was a good attempt for having no clue what the hell I was doing. <laughs> that was a pretty good attempt. Smash, smash the tips button. Smash it as hard as you can, as frequently as you can. Smash, 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 smash. hit them with a drill or a headbutt in this game, you don't have frame advantage. They can recover before you and throw you or hit you. Because every time I was hitting him with a drill or a headbutt, he would just mash low punches and would hit me. I couldn't do anything about it. So, it's weird. Again, he doesn't play anything like Dalsim in the other games. You gotta learn the whole fucking game over. That's why I hate this game. It doesn't play like other Street Fighters. They completely made a game that's not like Street Fighter at all. It's a gimmick fest. And I need to learn every gimmick in order to win. Like, if I remember correctly, I should have air thrown a million times because air throw beats like everything. I totally forgot about that. And you can try to make excuses and shit. Y your excuses mean nothing. It no matter what you're even trying to do, he'll trade or beat you. That was air throw, didn't fucking work for some reason. I couldn't do anything! I can't, I can't do that, it doesn't work. Just look at this! Everything I do is so delayed, there's no point in even trying. He's like, fuck this. Alright, I'm not picking him anymore. There's no point. I wish I'd Phil Chews, if I hit the tip skull, you should dump the money into Doge so we all make money. <laughs> no, I don't think I, I'm not doing anything, I'll tell you exactly what the money's gonna do. It's gonna go to my bank account, it's gonna sit there, and it's gonna pay bills. But like I said, I am completely strapped for cash right now. Completely, 100% because of all the stuff that I had to just pay that was, like, really high out of nowhere. Oh my god, he's drinking gin! But it happens. Nothing you can do. And the thing is, this month, January is historically always the absolute worst month for ad revenue on YouTube. On January, there are no advertisers because all the advertisers basically blew their budget for the, har the hardcore gaming season and or the busy Christmas shopping season. And once January comes, there's, like, no ads to go around. So my ad revenue just... It, the good news is it's not like it used to be. When I was a full-time YouTuber, oh my god, January was terrible. Luckily for me, I've diversified myself. And now it's mostly Twitch and a little bit of YouTube, okay? But it was hilarious. I just, I was curious. And I wanted to look at YouTube to see how I did this last month. It said, you were down 1% of viewers. Only 1%. So between December and January, 1% less views. So that means I'm consistent. You made 50% less money. Uh, I need that money to pay my WWE champions bills. Help! I'm not kidding. This is you made 50% less money because they don't know how to sell ad space in January. So, it's pretty funny. Um, but thank God, it's not like, it used to be world-breaking. Like, I remember in January, I used to come to you guys and be like, oh my God, I really need help because I'm not making no, any money this month even though I busted my ass and I put out a bunch of great videos. Um, but that's still going to affect me. You know, it is. It'll come when I get paid in February. When YouTube pays me half of what they usually do, it's going to be like, oh boy, it's going to be tight. So... Wish I feel true, so we gotta push Doge into a dollar. Yeah, again, I, I'm not investing. I have no money to invest. I really wish that I had a disposable income to invest. I have no money. <laughs> okay. I have nothing. Zero. No money in the bank account. This just TJ Gamebox is in the same faction as you in WWE. Now, wait a minute. Here we go again. 
Are you gonna fucking be a troll ass dickhead and start talking about you weren't you were saying things that were that were like legit questions, and now you're fucking talking about the stupid stupid attractor me of this fucking game that I don't play. I'm tired of this shit. Really, I don't want to talk about this fucking stupid shit that's not true. Do you really? I mean, obviously now you want me to ban you. It's like, do I really want to waste my time leaning towards the laptop to ban your dumb fuck ass? God, you're stupid. There's the salt, the delicious salt. Although tonight, everyone, please, if you can, please tip me. I really need help with this badly right now. So if you can tip me, I would appreciate it. It would be great if we get the vest tonight, but I don't know. So far, half an hour in, and uh, we are at a whopping $6 in tips, so I'm not so sure that's going to happen. Jasper, no! He did it again! That's it. I'm throwing him out. Jasper, you're out of here. You're out of here. I told you no. the tenth goddamn time he jumped in front of the TV. He's never done it that many times in one night. He's never done it that many times in one night. No, I didn't throw or hurt my cat. I picked him up and I placed him down in the hallway. And he was very upset because, oh, you kicked me out. You can tell. Like, yeah, he's, being, he's busy being a brat cat tonight. He wants all my attention. And it, what's weird is, he didn't come here earlier. He was asleep. And I didn't, I didn't wake him up or disturb him because I wanted him to get a nice nap downstairs. He always takes an afternoon nap. After dinner, when we eat, he takes like a two-hour nap. So I didn't want to disturb him or nothing. I was being all nice to him. And he has to come in here and jump in front of the TV ten times. Oh my god, he's drinking gin. Oh my god. So this is why I don't want to play Goji Things. I can't parry a single thing. I can't. I can't block, parry. I can't do anything. His connection is so bad, I can't do anything. I can't time it because it's all monster delay. So he just rushed forward to a hundred attacks. I can't guard against him because the, the, his connection is complete shit. Look at this. I don't want to play this guy. I can't do anything. Everything I'm doing is coming out half a second later. I can't react to anything he does at all. Yeah, I give up. I can't do anything. It's like, he can just keep walking forward and pressing buttons. I can't do anything about any of it. I can't. It's impossible to do anything about it because his connection is such garbage. So now I've been in this room for the past half an hour having fun. I can't play in the room anymore because the shithead with the terrible connection went in there and ruined it. He quit the room, dude. He's so embarrassed he quit the fucking room. He's like, fuck this shit. God damn, that's bad. No, I can do it. I'll, 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 any match I play against him, I could beat him in third strike. I've done it many times. It's been boring. I can't play a real match in third strike against him because he lags so bad. So he ruins the whole lobby with his terrible fucking connection and he stalks me because he's a fucking loser. Uh, Denny's a juicer. What a Jasper's a tractor. He's not a detractor. He's just an attention seeking young cat. Greatest of our gotcha said, Do you think Jasper could be deaf? Most cats understand the English language. No, he listens. Here's the thing if he's somewhere he's not supposed to be, he will listen to me. The problem is he didn't care tonight. He just wanted so much attention. He figured the only way I can get Phil's attention when he's playing Street Fighter, when I have this joystick on my lap, he goes, The only way he'll get my attention is by keep jumping in front of the TV. You know, he, he knows what he's doing. It's not like, you say, oh, he's misbehaving. No, actually, he's not purposely misbehaving just to misbehave. He's misbehaving because he wants my attention. If I was just sitting here petting him all night, he wouldn't jump in front of the TV. But I'm not going to sit here and give him attention constantly all night long. I got to have time to work, you know? Oh, my God, he's drinking gin. I try my best to be nice to him and to be fair. You know, it's just like being a parent. Of course, it's not like being a parent to a kid because you can't necessarily reason with a cat because the cat is not like a human. Um... You know, later, later on, I'll give him pets, and I'll make him feel loved, and I'll make him feel better, because right now, he's probably upset that I threw him out of the office. But what can you do, right? Greetings of our country, so keep it up. One day, you'll beat Goji Tanks. I'll believe in you. I've beaten him many, many, many a time. It's just not fun playing him, because I can't play the game like you're supposed to. You have to play it like a fucking insane lag fest, and it's just super duper unfun. I hate playing that fucking guy, because his connection is so bad. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, Jack's Rapture has tipped me $52. <laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. The cat trainer... Oh, here we go. The cat trainer... Uh, cheered and says, you watch too many movies, people don't spray their cats with water in real life, that's cool. Yes, they do, but it's not a good thing to do. It's an emergency thing to do. If he's about to do something where he can really hurt himself, you deter him the quickest way by doing this. It's all you can do. Like right now, if I'm in here and he comes in here and starts chewing on a wire over there, what am I going to do? How do I jump up and stop him? No, you're going to do this, you immediately stop doing it. All right, but you only do that if it's absolutely necessary. You're not supposed to discipline your cat in a negative way like that. Oh my God, he's drinking gin. Surely you've changed your phone number since though, right? It says messages. I'm not telling you anything about what phone number I have or don't have. Like, <laughs> of course, remember the conspiracy theory is Phil always has the same phone number and it proves a million things that his phone number is the same. And I'm not going to say shit about any of my private stuff at all. That's just troll bait. That's just troll bait to try to get personal information about me, Phil. You know? will get no information from me and my moving plot again. Engage. What the fuck was that? 
I was over it. I couldn't cross it up. Oh my god, the fucking lag is incredible. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, I was gonna leave the lobby anyway. Now I'm definitely leaving the lobby after that laggy shit. What a great match. What a great fucking match. He quit. He rage quit. Did you see that? He quit the lobby. <laughs> So dumb. I'm just overall pretty good at all kinds of different games. You want to know the truth? I'm probably one of the best overall gamers in the country. That was fireball. Wow. I can't do anything. It keeps dropping my inputs. I couldn't do a dive. Yeah. I give up. This is terrible, man. I can't do anything. Do it. I just it doesn't come out. The lag is so bad with this fucking idiot. What the fuck kind of moronic connection does this dumb fuck have? It's that bad, dude. I mean, come on. And it sucks. I'm having fun in this lobby. I don't want to fucking play that guy again, right? I'll try to join a different lobby for the finale of the stream. But what was that? It was a complete waste of time. Oh shit! Someone who actually knows Street Fighter joined the lobby and fucked me up. Time to rage quit outfit like a bitch. I mean, goddamn. That's pathetic. Jesus, he knows exactly what he's doing. Get it right there when I hit him too. Oh, I baited it! I baited it! No, oh, I'm dead. That's it. Ah, that's it. That's the fat, the fat chubby hitbox of Fei Long. Even in the air. If it looks like he's jumping over a fireball, sometimes the fireball will catch him on the backside. So, alright, that was a good way to end it. That was a good stream. Again, thank you guys. I appreciate all of your support tonight. And again, thank you to those who didn't support tonight because I really need the help the next couple of weeks and I appreciate the help. Thank you. Thank you very much, everybody. Any moment, I can pick up a controller and I can play any game at professional level. Right now, being very honest and upfront with all of you, I am strapped for cash. I just had to unload my bank account in the last week to pay quarterly taxes, to pay uh, various other kind of year-end or year-start bills that happen that creep up on me every year. And yeah, they were pretty high. And next thing I knew, I was like, wow, I'm basically broke right now. Okay? Um, it sucks. But I'm just being honest with you. Okay? This is what just happened. And I'm going to basically be in this situation until I get paid by Twitch. Which is going to happen in the middle of February. I get paid by Twitch basically in the middle of every month. Okay? So the good news is, it's not going to last forever. The bad news is, it's definitely happening right now and it sucks. Alright? Now, if you contribute via tipping me, that would help a lot. When you tip me, those are funds I get right away. And that means that would help with the situation allow me to get through the next couple of weeks. Alright? Gotcha, game addict! As I stated earlier on in the stream, right now I am pretty financially strapped because of some things that come up pretty much every January and it's unavoidable. Basically, big quarterly tax bill plus a bunch of other things behind the scenes, all right? If you want to support me the most today, I urge you, please, if you can, tip me. I need tips, basically, to help me out in the next two weeks, okay? It would be really cool if we could hit the tips goal today. I just care about money. That I just can't help it. I'm so just enveloped in greed and money. I need money. I need money. There's still this back here. And it's still in the back of my neck, the back of my head, the back of my mind, and it's always telling me. It's WWE Champions time. I love it. Oh, I love it. Is, is a mobile game addict. Still has indoctrinated children who send him money. Blatantly milking for money. It's a money pit. It's gone. Just gone like that. In an instant, fucking gone. I just care about money. That I just can't help it. I eBay. Contributions are mandatory, but I need your help. I am appealing directly to you. No decency, no respect, no common sense, no fucking maturity. It's the guy who just doesn't get reality. <laughs>